play to the outside. Come on, man. We need this. Vince Wilford. What's up, everybody? It's you, Flacco, back again with another Madden YouTube video. Today, we have a video on Vince Wilfork at running back. You guys know every time Vince gets a card, it's kind of tr a tradition on this channel. We've done it last year. We did it for his 94 bow nose card earlier in the year, and the videos always do well. I think a lot of people love seeing it. It's kind of a series now anytime he gets a card. I'm super excited for it. I forget how much he weighs, but obviously, he's a big guy. I'm going to show you guys how to glitch any defensive card to play running back for you guys as well. And yeah, let's get into it. Make sure to smash that like button if you guys enjoy this one. We are at 12.5K, trying to get to 13K by the end of the month. Appreciate you guys so much. And yeah, let's get right into it. All right, so I did create a second lineup to show you guys. I don't have any backups on my team, as you guys can see. You don't want to back up anywhere on your offense or defense unless it's necessary. You guys can see only running backs here. And you also do not want to have a, an actual fullback here. So I put a tight end here, which absolutely helps me. And then when moving over to the defense, you guys can see it's all low overalls right it's all very low overalls besides whoever you want to be there right you're nine you want your highest overall this could be all 95 overalls in the 98 right whoever your highest overall is is going to be the guy playing there and this house rules as you guys know is the best form to get him because it's only one way in the game's over so we're just going to load into a bunch of offensive house rules and try to get some good plays but you guys can see we do have recuperation on him which will increase the fatigue or decrease of fatigue i guess you could say but you guys can see 82 speed 325 pounds his change of direction is 81 doesn't really have much of trucking at 35 i don't know how he doesn't have at least a little bit but I'm super excited. Let's go try to get at least two touchdowns with this card online. So once you get in the game, you do still have to do something here. All you want to do is go to an I-form. I think this works for any I-form close. It has to be I-form close, I'm pretty sure. And click the right stick until you see dual halfback swap. And you guys can see our guy Vince Wilfork is in at the running back. There he is. Hopefully we're not playing somebody too sweaty here. But let's see if we get a nice little run to the outside with Vince. Already a great start. This is much better than we normally get with him. And we're going to have, what, a 23-yard rush. Many of you guys know this is like, it's never like, like our best game with Vince Wolfork, I think. Or, yeah, it was a game. But we're in house rules now. It was like 100 yards and like two touchdowns. It was actually crazy. And as you guys could see, Vince is already passed out. If this comes down to it, we'll just go into our other formation and get him some breathing. And it looks like CMC is going to get a good block right there. And, yeah, let's get him out. Let's get a first down and get reset. That, that's the only thing. We have recuperation on him. So, maybe if he's not in the game like this, he'll be able to get right back in. And it looks like he almost... Okay, I don't know if that was like a glitch or what, but he just had a free run at us. It's just still tired. It didn't even show he was tired. I don't know if this is just like house rules glitching, but it literally did not show he was tired when we loaded up. And it looks like, oh my God, Larry Fitz, one of the best blockers. We have 32 yards rushing, but Larry Fitz, we need you there, man. Larry literally holds on for a second longer. I think that might have been another 15 to 20 yards on the board right there. And it looks like we're going to go to CMC again. We're just trying to maybe, okay, don't take a hit stick. Oh my, CMC's being great. Let's try to get inside of that five or actually close so we can get some nice little punching room in and it looks like Cooper Cup. Nice little catch there. We're moving forward. Can we hurry up from here? I Oh, we can't. Okay. I know where I'm at with this is like, I really like, it's like the first five plays before he gets like exhausted are kind of our big money plays we need with him. And it looks like we have nothing open here. And yeah, let's not be an idiot and take a sack there. We'll take that. Completely forgot we had a timeout. So let me try to go to I form. I know it's probably not smart to run on third and four, but it's, it's, we're really here for Vince at the end of the day. Let's get a big play to the outside. Come on, man. We need this. Vince Wilfork, we're going to hurdle over the guy as well. He's going to get his first. First touchdown of the video. I, I didn't even, I forgot we had a timeout. I mean, you cannot ask for a better start to the game. Let's go get a couple more. Looks like EA is absolutely blessing us with the ball first every time. Hopefully, we can have as much success this time as we did on the last game. Looks like we're going to try to juke there. Okay, then we're definitely not going to try. Maybe the Jurtle is glitchy with him. We'll try that one out. We have inside stuff, and of course he does. We're going to try to run a dive. We double teamed Linville. No way you got two hits. I didn't even look. Oh, I forgot. The extra AVP is giving a lot of people a dump, like many inside stuffs. You guys can see we're going to try to get him on this nice little wheel route. Looks like he's going to be open. A nice little dot to the... I mean, it's just so funny when I record these gameplays. I can't believe we just completed that. Funniest thing ever when you can move the ball. And so, like, they're, like this guy's in a good defense, too. Like, 3-3-5 wide is what I run. And, yeah, we're, we're kind of dead right now. Let's take a timeout. Let's also try to pick up a first down and bunch and... 
Let's reset. I forgot to tell you guys, the last time I recorded this, I was actually playing when there was like the run commit glitch. If you guys don't remember what that is, you could send three people and it would run commit if you ran the ball. But if you ran commit and they passed the ball, it would just reset to a normal play. And yeah, we were playing against somebody that was doing that last time we were recording this gameplay. And that was brutal. At least we don't have to do that anymore. We need to break one out. Like this defense, like I said, is a very hard defense to get to the outside on. And it looks like we might get solid blocking here. Dicko, we needed you to get outside a little faster. Oh, it, it's hard, guys. I'm telling y'all, you guys, can, like I said, try this with your friends. You can do this with corners, safeties, anything. It's really fun. Like you, you also have bad defense. If you're going against your friend, you both will have bad defenses as well, which is super dope. And let's see if we, oh my God, Vince. Okay, Vince. Okay, Vince. Let's get into a third game. Very unluckily, you guys can see this guy literally has nine people in his box in the third game here. Looks like we're going to be playing a sweaty guy who wants to stop Vince as Vince still gets seven yards in the first rush against a nine-man box. I just love it, man. It's literally just so fun to me. We're going to try the wheel route again. All you got to do is do that, basically, and hopefully we don't get crazy blitz here because of the... Okay, I did not mean to do that, but we'll take it, boys. Let's try to set up that wheel route again. So I guess it's going to that side. I can't really pick a side. That's oh, I I always thought that was really weird. But let's see if we get a. I'm trying to distract him with his user. Something like that, maybe like this. I don't know. Let's see if I did it again. I'm not. I swear I'm not doing that on purpose. Set the play back up. Let's see if we get a nice little play. We're gonna dump it down to Vince Wolfork. It looks like in the third game, I think this is the guy we matched up with in the first game. I know we played against him when recording this. So hopefully we have the same exact results here. We've been getting offense every game, which has been awesome as well. EA is absolutely blessing us. It probably thinks I'm some, like you guys can see, he's gonna obviously adapt. He probably thinks I'm the nastiest player in the world. As we're gonna get a nice 10 yard run to start. It is so scary with him because like, I might have to put conservative on. He's been fumbling. When first off, we got to check and of course he has inside stuff. We're going to flip it to that side as he mo- Okay, this is perfect. We should be able to get really- CMC, ah. Uh, really needed a cut block out of CMC here. This is really our best play out of this because like I said, we have to stay in this formation, sadly. But let's see if we get a good a little play. I don't know, this is kind of a nasty play. But it looks like Vince on the wheel route is gonna get wide open. Nice little spin move that's gonna carry us for another 10 yards. Hey, we're moving, we're moving, boys. Double team that inside stuff and let's get going. Let's see if we can get out of here. He has a five man D lineman. Oh my God, Vince, there he is. Vince with another eight yard run. He's moving, boys. Vince was definitely red barring, so we'll give him a couple plays off. Let's see if we can move down into the end zone or near it so we can get some big plays out of Vince and CMC. Bro, the CMC is just so good. He literally never drops nothing, no matter what. Play here to move and it looks like Cooper Cup's gonna be the guy that's gonna be wide open. Thank God we did not fumble there. I can substitute him into every formation. We'd be in a good spot. Looks like he has three, only three down linemen on this one. So we should be able to get outside. Look at Vince going and oh man, it's so hard. It looks so good, but it's like, like that's a touchdown with any other back, but our guy Vince, he likes to do it the slow cooking way, but let's try to get closer. I don't want to use him every play because we still got to punch this ball in, which is going to be a very tough decision if we don't have him or even if we have him as a red bar. Let's just get one more play to get closer, and then it's Vince season right after this. Looks like we're going to literally, like, he cannot guard this play for his life, and we really didn't get anything there, actually. And as you guys can see, I actually just, like, I don't know what happened, but I clicked the same play, and Cooper Cup is in the game. I don't know, but Cooper Cup, let's go, man. Cooper, yeah, yeah, okay, never mind. That's not a good play. I don't know what's going on. Team is literally in shambles right now. It is it. And Ray Lewis. Ray Lewis just got absolutely rocked in the guys. I don't know. As you guys can see, it's actually a glitch. So if we go to dual halfback swap where we usually sub them in, you can't like it's like super okay. He took the timeout. Yeah, this guy might be blessing us. I I don't know if you guys just saw what I did, but I clicked the wrong play. All right, so we're gonna literally hand the ball off and fall down. Oh, this is so painful. Let me do this. Oh, what a bad play. We just lost a yard. Well, he's in goal line, so we should be able to get to the outside here. Hopefully a little bit on this stretch. Come on, baby. We just need a dive. Vince Wolfork is gonna get his second touchdown of the video. Absolutely went off. I, 
Dude, this is always a great video to record. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to smash that like button if you guys enjoyed this one. Like I said, this is like one of the traditions on the channel. I absolutely love doing. I know a lot of people who love seeing this as well. Let me know if you guys enjoyed it and how could I make this style of video better? Like the meme, the troll videos. I try. I know I'm really limited on the play calling I could do out of it, but we're trying, man. I think it's a fun video to do. Let me know any feedback you guys have and I hope to see you guys in the next one. Peace out, boys.